This is Quick Tips from the Metal Roofing Learning Channel, brought to you by Western States Metal Roofing, where you can buy Factory Direct and save 15 to 50% on your materials. Overlapping Peak Trim When measuring the distance of your trim, you should account for 6 inches needed at overlaps and 1 inch needed at ends. Start by notching out the hem 6 inches by half inch. This will allow the trim to fit into the adjacent piece. Silicone sealant should be placed on the lower trim. Fastening. Lap screws should be placed on the gable side edge as shown here. Clean off any excessive silicone sealant. When attaching the peak trim, the screws should line up with the foam closures. Prior to fastening the screws, you should snap a chalk line along the foam closures. This will help ensure that the screws not only go on straight, but also penetrate the foam. Whenever possible, you should align the peak trim fasteners with the screw lines on your roofing panels. You should place a fastener on the high seams on each side of the overlap. Additional fasteners should be placed on the back side of the peak trim, 12 inches on center. You can find step-by-step -step installation videos and homeowner guides on our channel. And don't forget to show your support by hitting the like button and subscribe.